For the last three years, Motorola's business has been so shaky it was very close to hitting rock bottom when it failed to develop a hit phone after the Razer. One step it took to rebuild the business was the decision to split its mobile devices and home division from its enterprise mobility and network unit into two separate and publicly traded companies. Motorola's handset division jumped on the Android bandwagon and has so far reaped some short-term success. In North America, Motorola, along with HTC, have helped popularize the Google Open Source OS on smartphones. But for the Enterprise division, it has no plans to ditch its long-standing relationship with Microsoft. The heritage of the Motorola Enterprise business um, you know, comes from the, the symbol business that we acquired three years ago. So they have a long track record in terms of working with, with Microsoft over the years. We've got millions and millions of enterprise class devices out in the field uh, with a variety of customers, um, you know, very large in retail, uh, very large in transportation and logistics. So often people that, you know, for example, would come to your house um, to drop off a parcel and ask you to sign a device, it would very often be a Motorola device. Built on the Microsoft Windows Mobile 6.5 platform, the ES400 Global Enterprise Digital Assistant enables workers to collect data and access business applications and back-end systems on the spot. At ES400, a very new uh, adventure for us, um, taking the enterprise market down into new segments. Uh, very powerful smartphone appearance, but built specifically for enterprise. So we've hardened the device up in terms of layering on um, some applications and features um, onto the device that make it stand out against the consumer smartphone type uh, devices. So very rugged, um, durable, uh, so it has IP ratings, so it makes it uh, resilient to splash and uh, water ingress, you know, kind of um, useful in the, um, the field service uh, environment. It's got Windows Mobile 6.5.3. Um, so new new software release from Microsoft, which is very good as well, and uh, you know really is with a light device as well. Uh, so it's not heavy; it's not um, too heavy for people to use out in the field. Motorola's long talk of splitting its operations is now expected to take place in the first quarter of next year. Well, that's it for this week's news desk. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.